Hey, today we'll be reviewing the Rode NT USB Mini. All right, this came in the mail today. Let's see what's inside. Let's check it out. All right. Some standard packaging. Not too much in here. Just the box, as expected. Move this aside. And there you have it. The Rode NT-USB Mini, the successor to the popular full-size Rode NT-USB microphone. At a price point of 99 US dollars, this is strategically positioned to compete with popular mid-range USB microphones such as the Blue Yeti and the Blue Yeti Mini. Let's take a closer look. Now some of the features touted in this microphone are its ability to provide studio-grade sound in a compact and easy-to-use package. It provides direct monitoring with zero latency, volume control, and the ability to mount to an external stand for greater flexibility. The microphone comes with a USB cable in the package, a USB-C to standard USB-A. It also comes with an adapter to convert from the 3 8 thread to 5 8 thread if you want to mount it to a conventional microphone stand. Let's take out the rest of the packaging. Here's the body of the microphone. It comes mounted on its base already. It has some heft to it. You can see the construction is really good. With the exception of the base, which seems to have malalignment of the plastic insert right here. I can't seem to get it to press in, and I'm concerned that this will cause instability on my table and maybe make the microphone tip over. I'll have to contact customer service about that, and hopefully it's covered under warranty. Luckily, the rest of the body has rock solid construction with a steel and nylon grill, good magnetic action of the base, and a nice tactile feel of the main control button. The unique hinge design allows the microphone to be adjusted to any angle that you desire to allow for optimum recording. As I mentioned previously, this is a pretty hefty microphone weighing in at 585 grams. Its overall dimensions are 141.9 by 54.5 by 43.9 millimeters. The base has a diameter of 89.3 millimeters and a height of 11.6 millimeters. It's important to address this microphone directly from the front as it is a cardioid condenser microphone. This means that most of the sound it captures is from the frontward facing direction. It also means that it has a relatively flat frequency response from 20 Hz to 20 kHz. It's able to sample at 48 kHz at a bit depth of 24 bits. Condenser microphones such as these are known to have great sound and set up as plug and play. The overall design and functionality are great. This adjustment knob allows you to control the levels of zero latency monitoring. It also allows you to mute the output coming to your headphones, but unfortunately not the microphone input. At the back, we have a standard 3.5 millimeter headphone jack and USB-C for connecting to basically any device. I really think Rode has something special here. They've got a perfect combination of functionality, ease of use, and price point. I definitely see this as a great tool for having great sounding audio anywhere. By the way, all vocals were recorded on this microphone with zero post processing. Let me know what you think below. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button below to let me know and hit subscribe to the channel. I'd also love to hear your comments below. Take care.